Reinhardt now back up with a hammer down, readily available. When are we going to see happening? There it comes out, big slam! While the Sigma launches them up in the air. Can they follow up here? Gets one, gets two. And here comes mid Kent pushing it past that checkpoint already. Um, but I think that this is going to be a bit of a problem for for, her, for Wilkins to be able to come in. They're using a flux, so we're going to see if they can potentially a cap the point. It doesn't look like they've switched it for now. Um, but it's not over. <laughs> Goose is just it's swinging. Not mid Kent just pushing through that Giga Chad aggro oh. right, going forward, making that space. But, but Goose there with some huge. Uh, Huge fire strike there, catching a couple of people and just cornering that soldier in there, making so much space for the rest of the team. Do they, do they realize there's a Ryan in the back line? There's the Bastion in the back line, just ripping through the shield that running through his goose game with this big hill to just get through everyone. Goose. Oh, big just goose. That big Reinhardt Alpha huge. energy. Huge what a plays. first game. Really decisive there for Midkent Hercules. Wilmington on the Ascenders and looking to get one more pick here. But who is going to be the target priority? They take out the Lucio. Looking at the Orisa next. Orisa is down. And also the Kiriko. This is a very quick cap for the team there as they take point one. While the rest of the team are trying to get some damage through. The Ryan holding shield but Bastion from behind the cover going in with the ult. Takes out two, the Reaper and the Kiriko. Three people down in quick succession. And the, the Reinhardt, I believe he got Nano there just to keep him alive. Whereas Ryan's a little bit more being able to charge around and reposition as we win. Yeah, and as you can see, the Orisa got out of position, staggered massively to the team. So if they're going to regroup, it's going to take a while, which does allow the mid Ken to make a really strong push and get a lot of possession. Uh, but yeah. Owen, taking out both healers, this uh, is a massive for them, allowing them to get even more uh, presence on the car and push. Yeah, a lot of ults uh, coming online for mid to play soon. Uh, Wilmington did manage to stabilize and hold it here, but can they win this fight? This is a fight that they really do need to win in order to uh, keep going and make it a lot easier than themselves. As Rock Crozen taking out four of the team Ooh. there. Yeah, and uh, here you go, Goose again. They're just keeping that corner because even if they die, they're just delaying them being able to touch. Uh, they need to be able to stabilize a little bit, get Belushio. Now it's just cool. Legs is going to try and jump on the point as well. But the Bastion just holding a corner, looking for anyone who's coming on and being able to throw down so much damage. Everyone on the cart, hopefully, they're going to try and push it over as quick as they can as soon as they remove the ball. But the rest of the team trickling in. Slowly but surely, just trying to take time off that timer. Make sure that it gets down as low as possible to give them the best chance possible in the next round when they're on the attack. And with that, mid Kent Hercules completes it with 1 minute 29 left on the clock. Doesn't get much, but does quite a bit of damage there. But everyone is focused on and a huge anti nade taking out a lot of the team there. Quirky Frog goes down, as does Dillywack and the Lucio. And there goes Jumpy Wizard and the rest of the team. And it looks like. Orisa Crozon got staggered because Kiriko unfortunately stuck in no man's land. Can they escape? Unfortunately not. And that's a great stagger from uh, mid Kent Hercules. He's getting so pocketed, aren't they, man? Use, use the ult from Lucia to keep them alive, get onto the point. But that uh, Bastion with the Nano doing so much damage, knowing full well that uh, Goose Games to look after him. And a victory shatter on the Sigma there. Mid Kent, take that game. But yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try and make it uh, keep talking until uh, Serve could get back. But in the meantime, the fight is in the favour of mid Kent Hercules here. They are playing on the point there, and as a result, they have got two. They've got three, and the Sigma unfortunately cannot push forward here. Should they need it, yes. mid Kent still holding the point, not pushing forward. Have we got Serve back? Here? I am back. Serve, you what can do take you a breather. What do you think of this here? <laughs> uh, this is just showing the, the, the absolute. Dominance of uh, of Goose here, just being able to that presence, really good. I think it's not just about being going ham all the time, but just some really good shield management, knowing when to keep it up, knowing when to be aggressive. Um, it is a typically really strong Widow pick. Um, 
Widow map, sorry. Um, but mm -hmm. if you're shooting into a shield, you know, you've got to try and feed those lines, that, those shots around the shield. And um, so it's very difficult to try and really. Exactly, push but here's the, his opportunity to take out Pugs here instantly. Pugs is down. Great work for Prozor, but the rest of the team, Jumpy Wizard and the Lucio, down. Prozor takes out the uh, Mercy. It's huge. This is an opportunity to take down the Rhine. Just punch him. That's all he needs. He goes down. Huge work there from Prozor. This allows him to go on to Still the Bastion. Uh, Bastion doesn't have any heals. And there we go. There Good we go. Come Instantly. Back. The, the Bastion going with the ult. Trying to make them some space there. Gets a couple of kills. Goose Gamer following up there with a huge fire strike. Damage boosting. Drizzy coming in to clean it up there. And that, there goes the rest of the team. Down. But what's going here? Goose Gamer takes down Dillywag. Crozen takes down L25. The huge, huge oh, attempt touch by Owen. But so enough, they don't touch. They just don't touch. Mid Ken win the series. Push forward, and at this point in time, the Dragon Blades have got control of the map. Echo putting in a beam there as the Arisa just pushing them back there with the spin and the spear. Uh, and with that, Craven Cartage uh, College should be losing this first team fight with the Dragon Blades taking it and pushing it further. The Moira are coming out there trying to heal the team up while damaging the Arisa there as they take control of the robot and push it back. Infuse takes down Rukichan and Souls takes down Zefti. Craven Cottage with the team fight win there. Does do damage for shields? Yes, the Infused Barrier is going to help. Big, very aggressive, the loving it. Takes out two and puts a lot of damage onto the rest of the team. The Zarya very low and goes down there. And two more damage. Unfortunately, not great bit of healing from Milky and Walter White there, keeping them alive. And as a result, Dragon Blades. Three quick uh, kills there, and a fourth as Zefty takes on Squills, and they're able to push the, uh, the robot back. The robot a little bit further, close to the end. Bob coming out from Big Anthony. Is this the turning point where they're trying to take control? And it's not Big Fudge with a huge tire. Take out the team, and this is where the Dragon Blades need to regroup and try again here. Doesn't get much value, but as of, but unfortunately, Craven have to stay on the point. They need to win the next couple of fights there in order to win this map. Uh, Rukachan pushing forward, trying to deny them space. Take them off the point. Takes out Big Andy. As a result, they get pushed back. Can't get back. They can't get back on the point. Really well played there for Rukachan. But Craven looking to push forward here. They are making a lot of space. They have got through that tunnel choke there for the most part. Uh, but Rukachan just trying to hold them at bay there. But unfortunately, it looks like they've pushed through. There's only a minute left. Can they get on the point here, Craven, and take the point? The, the tire comes out. It's free! Huge. Big fudge! Tire! Big Andy following up! It's the big boys the battle here. And Big Fudge and Big Andy come out on top, giving that victory to Craven College as they take the first point. Great work there. Stopping that fire engine from going too far under that tunnel at this point. Oh, but Blessing Big Andy! Huge death loss, really well timed in that choke. And uh, with that, it looks like Craven College have got that team fight victory uh, by, by the junk right there. It's all out carnage, the ultimate coming out from Infused now. And as they, they neither team are giving up, they and both want dying. this. Yeah. But uh, Craven College taking uh, the, the ascendancy here takes out the Junkrat, the Orisa looks to go down and they do finally cap it but again more time taken off the clock by the Dragon Blades. They clearly shown that they have a mastery of this sort of map but Dragon Blades not to be outdone, they have come back, they are stabilizing, making sure that they are grouped as they're going and as a result they do take two big kills in Big Andy and, uh, and Souls there. Can they stabilize and to finish off this team fight? It looks like they should do here quite easily. Uh, Rukachan taking that. Milky finishing off Big Fudge. Yeah, final fight territory now. They've probably only got one real attempt on this. Big Andy does have a death blossom. A big a noodle to goes noodle in. really early. Big Andy <laughs> looking for that flank. Goes in. Doesn't goes get out. it. <laughs> yeah, Zefti saw that coming, took them out instantly. 
denied in that threat. Craven College, a little bit difficulty as they got uh, two down. But in the in comes Rukachan with the ult, takes out Noodle. Zefdan in the back with a tire available. Can they finish this off here? It looks. We have such. Yeah, that actually said. But uh, Big Andy trying to wrap behind, going above. Then they give a little flank down. All the sim turrets. Sim turrets are taking the, uh, the damage, and as well, Ruka was able to finish them off pretty quickly. Ruka Chan takes two. Lucky takes a third, and this should be very quick wow. uh, for Dragon Blades. I mean, they've, they've got through the top apart now, Dragon Blades. Um, they've still got that high ground they need to be careful of. Um, and that's the problem, you have to push under this kind of the new car wash. Uh, big oh, fudge big much. with the rip tire. It's two for two. It is two for two. Uh, and the, the, the but uh, both their healers, uh, Craven College still have one. That could be what is going to keep them alive and get them the win. Big Andy using the ult there. Trying to guarantee that so that they can stabilize it. But uh, Zefty not getting, going down without a fight. Uh, noticing that Big Andy is going straight for Lucky. But uh, Zefty taking out the Moira. Big, big damage there. Uh, Rukachan taking out the Junkrat here as well. They are in the lead. They should be able to count this Red Team Cookie. The change onto Hogbine Fuse. Fantastic choice against this Orisa. But is it enough? Uh, at this point, it doesn't look like they'll be able to stop them from capping. And they will have to take uh, a, a regroup here. Hog still providing that huge body there, not allowing any space, but does go down to Ruka Chan and Walter White as they push it through to the final phase here. Craven College looking to regroup, but Dragon Blades with a lot of ults available. Yeah, nice cheeky little spot here for Big Fudge. It's probably going to lose life there, but does get another 20% or so ult charge, um, which they are going to need to be able to keep Dragon Blades, I think, off this final push. A big hook. But Hog has been nerfed. Yeah, and it was a. Uh, if, if you notice, like the Lucio did boot the way just to like dis uh, disrupt the aiming and everything, yeah. while keeping uh, uh, Rukachan alive. Great team play there, like, noticing how to help the team. Wow, that spear, was a nice spear. <laughs> out of the air. Rukachan going in, taking out the big fudge. That is a big, big uh, pick there, um, leaving them without a large source of burst damage. The Reinhardt here, trying to get onto space, hitting that Lucio. Rukachan looking for space on the uh, Numbani Olympic team for Javelin there, by the looks <laughs> of it. And they we can't take touch. it. Nope. Going to that golden box of victory. Dragon Blades take the win. They are 2 0 up. Yeah, I mean, uh, big, big Andy there doing loads of damage, not getting with the picks, but 70% ult charge. Um, before getting taken out, we probably have a dragon now if he didn't get picked off. Um, and then the, the, the trouble now is if you're lacking the damage. Dragon Blade, the Craven College. Rukito going in with the ult, takes out Soul, then takes out Big Andy. Lucky takes out Big Fudge, but the last line of defense was infused. You couldn't do it. A team kill, and I think this should be the first round for the Dragon Blades. Uh, you know, Defense Matrix is a fantastic tool, but how much can they get of it? Big Fudge with the early kill onto Walter White, but Rukachan getting revenge. Take out Big Fudge. Milky reses Walter White. Dragon Blades with the full team there, taking control of the point. But Big Andy takes down Lucky. It is a 5v5 right now. Infuse looking to try and focus Rukachan, but they are being pocketed by the Mercy there. <laughs> and, uh, and as you can see, it's allowed enough time for Rukachan to come back. Rukachan has got their ult. So does Infuse though. Infuse choosing not to use it. Uh, the emo field comes out from Noodle, trying to keep them alive. But Rukita going in, got three in there, and takes them with the help of Zefty and Walter White. Potentially just pop the pop, pop visor. Nice. There goes the visor. Should be able to get a couple off this, and they do. That's a lot of value of that, and but, but with a kill and a lot of damage on the rest. Pushing them off the point. They do flip it, but at this point in time, Craven do need to touch. The Diva going in. Get the touch. Triggers over time. Great work, but is it enough? At this point, Craven Col uh, College are trickling in. 
Lucio, their noodle coming in, but uh, keeping it going, making a menace of themselves. But uh, Walter White showing who's the better Lucio there. Big Andy trying to get the kill, but Zefty cleaning up. This looks like it, it's all over, and it is. The Dragon Blades with a dominating win there, three nil. Yeah, it, it's been close in the maps up till then, but that was their map for definite Dragon Blades, just showing how impressive their Arisa is.